Sometimes you just want to be around people who get it, who understand your struggles, your frustrations, your unique situation, but also like to laugh and have fun. Marsha Bonhart takes us to that place for kids here at home. It's an example of what's working in the Miami Valley. Well, millions of people are living with the loss of limbs. Millions more are at greater risk for amputation. But there's a local camp for young people who are amputees. It's a place that gives them the freedom to explore and have fun. I thought since this metal would be heavier. Clarksville, Ohio comes alive in the summer when scores of youngsters show up for five days of exploration and fun. We got ropes course and climbing walls, fishing, canoeing. This is where the Patty Rosbach Youth Camp caters to young people who, for whatever reason, have lost an arm or leg, or sometimes the limb loss is plural. I was born with uh, it's a really long name, but I call it tibial aplasia, okay. and I had it amputated at six months, I think, wow. and um, I've had a prosthetic ever since. We want to have enough room for everyone to Campers go, are here okay? from all over the United States and Germany. It's really fun, you know, having all the people that are just like you around and not having to have everybody, you know, staring at you because usually when you walk in a place and, you know, you're one-armed or one leg, they're always like, oh, well. You know, they're just not used to it, so. Each camper energetically has a story to tell about their disability without apology. The same holds true for the counselors. All, all the counselors have been through everything that the, uh, that the kids have been through, so um, the ki the, we're, we're no different than the kids. They can talk to us. The young people say the camp is life-changing. They learn life can be normal. And outside of this fun wilderness, they often find themselves the objects of bullies. Here, all images are understood. At other camps, it's like, oh yeah, that kid has like no leg and something. Now that no kid can really say that because they, they they only have one leg too. There's no push to hurry, just to do well with any of the many activities the campers choose. I've been living my whole life with a prosthetic, and I've just gotten used to doing things differently than everyone else. More than 600 young people lose their limbs annually to accidents. Marsha Bonhart, Two News, working for you. Great story. Thank you, Marcia.